Okay, well Matt launched in the L39 on his first solo over to Oshkosh. We just finished up the brief here. We'll go fly the mass arrival with the Bonanzas to Oshkosh. This is the most boring flight of this trip. Charlie flight, there's a Chinook converging. Switch the gun. We got two bogeys joining the flight apparently. Clear to land, 3-6 left and right, Bonanza flight 109. Okay, so Matt flew on over to Oshkosh in the L-39. Now we're bringing up the tail here in the Bonanzas to Oshkosh formation, 100 and some Bonanzas. We'll find out here in a second when he calls for takeoff clearance. But he chunks is leading the formation this year. You guys probably remember him, the uh, fun guy from the formation clinic video a couple of years ago. Okay, before takeoff, we got controls are free and correct. Well, we won't worry about the door. Uh, instruments, gas, we got fuel, we're on the fullest tank. Attitude and autopilot's fine. Run up. Seatbelts, switching safety. So yeah, this is probably going to be the about the most boring Bidash flight yet because it's the only time there's ever not been weather. Like there's always weather. There's a weather delay. We're flying through around crazy weather. End up diverting because of weather, uh, and now it's all way off to the west this year. So we might get some interesting weather at Oshkosh tonight. But uh, for the flight, it's actually going to be perfect for once. It's kind of interesting. So we're going to be on the left wing in the Charlie 8 element. Cool. We are parked. So yeah, this is the event we uh, have a bunch of clinics for, so everybody can kind of learn how, how this works. It's on fly formation. The um, goal of most of those is to kind of get people proficient for this. Some of them, you know, we do more advanced training and FFI cards and stuff like that for air show stuff. But yeah, it's Drake Golf, you're still on Lacrosse Tower. Now we're here and at Oshkosh. Definitely the, one of the coolest ways to get to Oshkosh, that's for sure. We're waiting for the flagman to come up here to launch the flight. Bonanza tail is November 570 Tangle. November 570 Tangle, in case somebody does have to do a go around and can find him on their ADSB. Alpha 1 rolling. Roger. There we go. What was it 15 second spacing between each one? Yeah, 15 second spacing between elements. I think between flights like the Alpha Bravo, Charlie, etc. There's a little bit more space. Charlie flight is rolling. Traffic, 3 o'clock, uh -oh. same altitude, 0 miles. That's like 80 knots. My airspeed indicator might be wrong, but it's not that wrong. Can you read what it says on that yellow car? Is it climb is 100? Or is it 100? Yep. Okay. 500 feet per minute to 3,000. We're at full throttle here. Baron lead is rolling. Traffic, 12 o'clock. Same altitude, less than one the, mile. Uh, Mississippi River in the back. Bonanza tail rolling. Is, right? Mississippi? Yeah. 
Charlie Flight, there's a Chinook converging from uh, right to left. Which element? King Air, uh, 3 Julia Kilo, turn right, Charlie 4, remain this frequency. 300 about. Right on Charlie 4, remain this frequency, and we're heading over to Golden. No, don't. He's Roger. descending. Yeah, let's fly right into the Chinook. Let's let's do that. This will make for a good video. It looks like he's descending. Charlie Flight, climb back up to 3,000 feet. Now we just follow the guy ahead of us. Follows the guy ahead of him. We can dodge cash. Pretty straightforward. Could go more smoothly, but. We got some unsuspecting traffic off the right. Charlie Flight. 996 Victor, you got someone off your right wing for 300 feet above you. I'm more concerned with the guy 100 feet above. Traffic, 12 o'clock, same altitude, less than one mile. Where are we Traffic, going? 12 oh, o'clock, same altitude, less than one mile. How does this not see the 30 planes in each direction that are visible to him right now? Like, is he just trying to get a good photo? Does he really not see this? Like. Charlie 5, we have uh, an airplane right off the right of us, uh, trying to join our flight. Charlie 5, we have a Cessna who has joined our flight right in front of us. Uh, yes, sir. We have to descend on my call. You need to do what descend. This is Charlie Lee. Do what you need to do to avoid the conflict. Charlie 5, descending 300. Why is he descending? Maintain visual with him or something? But, wait, but switch the gun. Did you hear that? Yeah. Just switch the gun. Yeah. But he said something about a Cessna, like, that doesn't look like a Cessna, no, it's it like does. a low wing. It's a low wing. Traffic is a Cessna doing 136 knots off the ground. Is this a different guy they're talking about? Do we, I mean, there were like two actually kind of converging, so maybe he is talking about somebody else up there. Because we're Charlie 8, there'd be three ahead, and this guy looks like he's just like, oh, see basically this. one ahead. You see uh, the Cessna I don't. too? Like I a high wing go, like, nope. so Charlie 5, so it'd be about three elements ahead. Do you see like an extra plane up there? Three, three, one, two, three. Hey, I don't. Charlie 7, we've got uh, traffic remaining directly below. We're going to climb up. 200 feet. We got two bogeys joining the flight, apparently. You don't see another another guy up there a few elements ahead? Like one, two, three. It'd be that third one on the horizon there. Oh, like that lowest one from our perspective. I see the low one. I see one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah. Charlie 5 taking the jog to the right, and Cessna is determined to join the flight. Wasn't quite as boring of a flight as I thought. Oh, I'm gonna look out the window for a little bit. Okay. Starting to feel it a little bit? Yeah. Oscar's Tower, bonanza flight of 109 bonanzas, 20 miles out. We're at Saudi intersection inbound for runway 36 left and right. Bonanza flight, clear to land runway 36 left. Bonanza flight in runway 36 left, runway 36 right, clear to land. Clear to land, 36 left and right. Bonanza flight 109. Let me know if you need to get out of here. Northern highway, turn left. Oh. Doing okay? I'm um, okay. You're down, lights on. Just in case. You oh. got it. Sure, thanks. There's a, there's a little bag inside the big bag, is how those work. I mean, there's, there's like, a plas like a real plastic bag that you pull out and open up. You don't throw up in the paper bag. In general, looking down probably won't help. Looking straight ahead is usually what they recommend. Out to the distance, horizon, beautiful clouds, a lovely lake here that we're next to. Harley Hayes, gear down, lights on. See, we should be above the element ahead of us on like a nice, you know, probably five degree glide path, call it. And it said we're like, we we're below them for a second. Really dragging this in. So it's the aim, like, instead of, so right now we're aiming for like the end of the runway, we're supposed to aim for the purple dot. Land like well beyond it. Baron 2, gear down, lights on at Pover. Traffic, 12 o'clock, same altitude, less than one mile. So what do the people on the chairs do? Watch airplanes. Yeah? 
Busiest airport in the world. Take off and landing right every 15 seconds. Crazy to be here and the grass is actually still solid. Because usually it's been like you know pouring rain all day or it was pouring rain all day yesterday. You get in here and it's just like this slushy mud fest. I've never gone to Oshkosh and the ground was actually solid. Kinda great. Good flight, eh? Yeah. All good to plan. Pretty much. Surprising. It's really impressive formation. Well, it's uh, about the first year that we've done it with the, no weather concerns, no you know major kind of hiccups here and there and stuff. It's uh, it was a little weird. <laughs>